In Aaron Rodgers' much-anticipated return to the field after his Achilles injury, the San Francisco for Niners dominated the New York Jets with a 30-2-19 victory. Rodgers, who played his first full game since his devastating injury in 2023, struggled to find a rhythm. While he completed 167 yards with a touchdown, he also threw a critical interception. The for Niners capitalized on their strong defensive presence, particularly controlling the line of scrimmage, which kept the Jets' offense in check for most of the game. Jordan Mason stepped up for the for Niners, rushing for 147 yards and a touchdown in his first career start. This performance helped the for Niners maintain control, especially since their star running back Christian McCaffrey was unexpectedly sidelined. Quarterback Brock Purdy also contributed by managing the game efficiently, throwing for 231 yards, without turning the ball over. Debo Samuel added to the offense with a short touchdown run, and kicker Jake Moody tied a franchise record by hitting six field goals. The Jets' offense, led by Rodgers, started slowly, going three and out on their first drive. However, they found some momentum in the second quarter, and Rodgers connected with Brees Hall and later set up a touchdown run. Unfortunately, the Jets couldn't sustain that energy, as they didn't secure another first down for the remainder of the half. Rodgers' frustration mounted as he was unable to consistently evade the Niners' pressure, resulting in crucial mistakes. Despite a late touchdown to Alan Lazard, the Jets couldn't close the gap. Rodgers' return was expected to rejuvenate the Jets, but San Francisco's dominant performance highlighted their defensive prowess and offensive depth. The game ultimately showcased the for Niners' ability to win in all phases, while the Jets were left searching for answers in their season opener.